Just Chili TV. All right, so 1015 Jams, 1015 Jams.com. I got the boys from Notre Dame. Uh, the Team Beamus campaign rolled through the 1015 Jams studio. I got Jordan, I got Nick, and I got Jack. I'm not going to give you the last names because you know what? You can find out on the back of their jerseys, just watch the game film, find out where they go to college and stuff like that. Uh, we're going to start off with my boy Nick right here, the junior, the junior running back. We're expecting big things from him. Why don't you go ahead and tell me like about the season, like what it was like, you know, from start to finish? Because I know you guys decided to take on some of the bigger schools in the state. Well, yeah, we went up two divisions, kind of seen what we can handle with. But I mean, we start off kind of not as good, well as we thought, 0 and 3. And then the fourth game, as you know, Coach Bemis took absent, and then uh, we we won that game. After that, we kind of had some ups and downs, but finally won five in a row. Went to the playoffs, upset South Point. And then last game of the season was hard for all of us. I mean, fought hard, kind of not the way we wanted it. I mean, you got you guys. The story is very inspiring. Everything that you guys have gone through and did. Like, I mean, I can't imagine having to do something like that. Um, you know. In addition to obviously trying to juggle the social lives and you know uh, the practices and all that stuff, like what was it like? Like you're a senior now, like I mean, it was uh, definitely different without him, um, without Coach Bemis. And you know, uh, after the fourth game when uh, he decided to take his leave of absence, um, like Jordan said earlier, it was uh, really emotional in the locker room. And then uh, practice was kind of weird. But, I mean, the coaches kind of just tried to keep the same routine, um, same everything. Um, they did before in terms of practice schedules and stuff like that. I mean, and socially, I mean, it's kind of, it was, I mean, every day we see him at school, and so it was kind of weird not seeing him at school. We always joke around with him at school and see him at school, and he's kind of a, a big figure at Notre Dame um, in terms of teachers and students and like that. So it was definitely really different at school and socially, but I mean, we just, we just kind of just um, get through it, and uh, just the season just went on, and the coach tried to keep the same routine as it was before, and um, I mean, we definitely try to live like, I mean, he wasn't there, but I mean, he still is in our hearts um, and still uh, there spiritually. So. Now, Jordan, like you were talking about it earlier, like the community really has to get together. Mm -hmm. Now, you know, how, how was it over at Notre Dame? I know you guys are a small like Catholic school and... Um, everyone everyone uh, bonded. Uh, we all got tighter. Uh, the uh, faculty took a picture of Team Bemis, you know, everyone's always praying for him in classes and uh, you know, going to masses and stuff to uh, pray and uh, help him out spiritually. And um, you know, he he's a big, big person at our school. Everyone looks up to him. Even teachers look up to him. You can tell. And uh, so everyone I try to keep him in mind. All right. Now, also, uh, it started it started to grow. The team Beamus thing started to grow virally, and also. Uh, campaign has gone like all through the internet why don't you guys go ahead and like plug some of the uh, sites and um, uh, the Facebooks and all that you can uh, look at it at www.teambemis.com and uh, you can donate money to help them out uh, you can just look at the uh, all the celebrities and stuff holding up the team Bemis sign you can uh, you can see anything you want um, the Facebook page is team Bemis um, it's T A M B E M I S and uh, then the Twitter I think it's at team Bemis as well Okay. Um, so I mean, you can uh, anyone go on those uh, three different platforms and, and kind of look it up and see what it's all about and uh, support them and support the, the movement and the, um, as a community kind of bond. Around. And this is something that you guys are going to keep pushing forward even after you guys leave Notre yeah. Dame. The two yes. of you. Yeah. A lot of alumni actually have gotten really into it and got a lot of these celebrities to do it. So it's kind of cool. Okay. Yeah, I've seen I've seen the pictures. I see. I just saw Mac Miller. Pulled up the sign, Tyler, the creator. Yeah. Um, obviously, I got the Larry Fitzgerald. That was actually me and Rico's work. Um, then there's Steve Young today, popped yeah, up. Yeah, yeah. Um, incredible. Be honest, who's the biggest celebrity so far? That's that's held it up. I mean, and Phoenix probably fits. Larry Fitzgerald. Yeah, Larry Fitzgerald definitely. What about globally? I, I would probably say Tyler the creator, Mac Miller. I like Mac Miller. Mac Miller. Yeah. That's, 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 that's pretty dope. That was last night. That was sweet. Yeah. That's pretty dope. Yeah. Okay. All right. I appreciate you guys coming through, talking to us a little bit about this. Hey, we're gonna show love, and we're gonna make sure that you know. 1015 Jams takes care of this team doing this campaign with you guys. All right, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.